Hey everyone, James here with Tech's Dead Life, back with another free stride guide. Today it's Skittles. We are using our medium sized harvest right freeze dryer. We set the initial freeze to 0 degrees Fahrenheit, the dry temp to 150 degrees Fahrenheit, and the extra dry time to at least 4 hours. We go ahead and set the freeze dryer to get started as we prep our Skittles. Grab whatever flavor Skittles you have. I recommend a large 54 ounce package if you can find one at Sam's or Costco or BJ's or somewhere like that. We put about half a container of this on each tray. One pretty unique thing about Skittles is you can use shallow tray stackers to actually process double what you normally could. For example, with these stackers in our medium that has five racks, we can actually process 10. Try to spread them out as evenly as you can. They can be touching, but don't fill it up 100%. They will need some room to expand into. Make sure you enable candy mode. You don't want to run this on normal mode. There's no need to warm the trays or for mats or parchment paper, although the mats or parchment paper might help if you want to dump them into a container quickly later during post-processing. Once the process is done, the Skittles should be puffed up about two or three times as big as they normally are, and they should be white in the center. It's likely that not all of them will be puffed up, but likely about 95% should. You can use either mason jars or mylar bags for long-term storage. If you did overfill the tray a bit and they stuck together, it's not a big deal. You can really just squeeze them between your hands and they should just crunch right apart. And that's pretty much it. Super simple and super tasty. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell for more awesome freeze-dried guides. Catch you in the next one.